Psychedelics are amazing substances to alter consciousness in profound ways. And to be able to study these alterations not only expands our understanding of consciousness itself, but it also opens up new potential avenues of treatment for man's many illnesses. Psychedelics have been used since the beginning of human culture and because they enhance creativity and spirituality and transformation of the personal experience. And it would be a travesty for us not to explore how we can harness these incredible substances for the good of mankind. The studies we've been doing over the last few years have been serious using psilocybin and the latest brain imaging technology of fMRI and MEG. The other study in this series, which we had just completed, is with MDMA, and this study is investigating and finding the evidence of why is MDMA an aid for psychotherapy. The third study I'll be talking about is the Beckley's collaboration with John Hopkins, where we are studying um, the treatment of addiction using psilocybin as an aid to psychotherapy. I, I think the conference is a very exciting time to get together and meet um, collaborators and other people doing psychedelic research. And it is a particularly exciting time because since two years ago there's been an explosion of um, psychedelic research. Before that there was hardly any happening and it was a real fight to get any through the ethical approval boards. But now I think people are beginning to realize this is a very, very valuable field of research. And so it will be very exciting to see the full extent of what is happening in this field and to um, discuss possible collaborations in the future and where we most need to um, concentrate to advance this invaluable new scientific area of research.